Hey friends, welcome back to Bachelor in Land. I'm Bass and whoa, we have a shape colored dinosaur puzzle. Can you help me solve it? Yes, and there's a little magic at the end too. Okay, so let's figure this out. Let's start with this shape right here. This is a blue colored shape. Hmm. Let's see which dinosaur it belongs to. Can I just put it anywhere? No, let's look at the properties of this shape, which simply means let's figure this shape out. So this shape, I see there's a curve and there's a straight side. Hmm, it's a side, it's a straight part. Yeah, okay. Kind of reminds me of another shape that's also round, kind of like a circle. This is called a semicircle because you have only half of the circle. Ooh, where do you think this belongs? Yeah, good pointing right here. Take a look. This dinosaur has a kind of curved belly with a straight side. Yes, we did it. All right. What about this red colored shape? What do you think it is? Yes, let's look at its properties. Let's count the sides. The sides are the flat parts. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hmm, six sided shape. Let's count the vertices where it's the places where those two sides meet. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hmm, six size, six vertices. Oh, I know that. Hmm, hexa is a word that means six. Hexa, six. Hexa, gone. It's a hexagon. Okay, so let's look at our dinosaur friends. Where could this go? Good pointing. What about right here? Because look, one, two, three, four, five, six sided shape too. And it also matches the color red. Good observation. All right, next one. Let's look at this teal colored shape. What shape do you think it is? Oh, good one. Okay, let's double check. Okay, let's see how many sides does it have? One, two, three, four. Hmm. What about vertices? Four as well, yes. And what's really special about this shape is look, each side is the exact same length. Yeah. Okay, so this is called a square. Where can we put the square? Oh, yeah, take a look. Now, this is peculiar. This is a square, but this is kind of a different shape. Hmm. But it does match colors. So let's keep going. This one's really interesting. Oh, next one. Okay, what about this orange shape? What is this shape called? Let's see. All right, let's count the sides. One, two, three, four. Hmm. What about the vertices? One, two, three three, four. Interesting. It's, is it a square? No, because the square has straight lines. These are kind of on a diagonal. This one goes like this. That one goes like that. Mm. Oh, it's kind of like a house, the roof of a house. Oh, it's a trapezoid. Of course, a trapezoid, an orange trapezoid. Where can it go? Tell me to stop. Oh, stop. There it goes. Hmm. Is this right? No, I went too quick. It goes just there. Thank you for helping me. Next one. All right, we have this green shape. Let's count the edges. One, two, three. What about the vertices? One, two, three. Nice work. So this is called a tri, triangle, three angles in the shape triangle Ooh. oh oh what about if we put it here oh this dinosaur also has a triangle well done last one last one oh wow look at this shape yeah all right it's a dark orange shape that's for sure hmm. let's count its sides one two three four five what about the vertices one two three four five Five sides, five vertices. Oh, I know that a word for five means penta. Penta means five. Oh, a pentagon. Well, where does this pentagon go? Right with the last remaining dinosaur. Look, this one has one, two, three, four, five. Five sides too. And one, two, three, four, five vertices. All right. Now, what we're going to do is I'm going to say a name of these dinosaurs and I'm going to reach out and you're going to have a special thing. Are you ready? One, two, three. Here we go. <gasps> Whoa, we got more puzzle pieces. Take a look. <gasps> so 
so cool. Okay, what we have to do now is figure out which one is either the smallest or the biggest. I'm going to ask you a question. Can you point to the biggest puzzle piece? Is it this one? Or is it this one? Okay, so we know this one. Now listen to instructions. The big puzzle piece goes on top of the little puzzle piece. Ready? The big one goes on top of the little puzzle piece. Is this correct? Yeah. All right, so now let's put it back on the puzzle piece. Okay. Oh, whoa, well done. It looks like the dinosaur with the semicircle is done. All right, next one. Here we go. You ready? One, two, three. Oh, look at these puzzle pieces. Hmm, I wonder where they belong. Well, to figure that out, we have to put the small puzzle piece under the big one. So first, we're going to figure out which one is the small puzzle piece. Is it this one? Hmm, is it this one? Okay, now that we know that this is a small puzzle piece, let's put it under the big one. Ready? Under the big puzzle piece. <gasps> Whoa, where does this one go? What shape do you think goes inside? The trapezoid. All right, let's look at the trapezoid. And now let's put these puzzle pieces in. Fantastic. All right, next one, next one. Here we go. Which one's next? I don't know. One, two, three. All right. Oh, wow, look at that. All right. Hmm. I wonder what this shape is. Okay, we're going to put the small puzzle piece under the big one. I'm going to do it, okay? Oh, is this correct? Did I put the small puzzle piece under the big one? No, I put it on top. The small one goes under. Oh, look at that. Okay, so which one do you think this goes? <gasps> yes, the square. But you know what's quite interesting, friends? that this last outer shape kind of looks like a rectangle because there's two longer shapes and two smaller shapes. But in the middle, there's a square. All right, next shape, here we come. All right, oh, can you point to the big puzzle piece, please? It's this one. Now let's put it on top of the little one. It went on top. Hmm. Where does this go? Right there. Good pointing. It goes above the pentagon. Oh, just like that. How exciting. All right. Here comes the next one. You're doing fantastic. All right. The little one goes under the big puzzle piece. Point to the little one, please. Let's go under. Whoop, under. What shape do you think this belongs to? Try one, two, three, the triangle. All right, here comes the triangle. Well done, last puzzle piece, here we come. All right, which one is the big puzzle piece? This one, let's put it over the little one, just like that. This shape belongs to the one, two, three, four, five, six, six-sided shape. Yes, the hexagon, hexagon. Whoa, well done. And look, we did it. Let's figure out which dinosaurs we created. Whoa, look at what we have here. This will help us figure out which dinosaurs we created. All right, let's start with this one right here. Can you match that dinosaur onto this piece, please? Yes, it's this dinosaur right here. And if we read the name... It's a Yoro Raptor. Oh, nice work. That one has a trapezoid. What about if we look for this dinosaur? Can you find it on the board, please? Ah, oh, it's this one right here. It's the Ankylosaurus. Oh, cool. All right, so we figure out the yellow dinosaur, the orange dinosaur, and let's look for the pink dinosaur. Where is the pink dinosaur on our board? 
there it is. That dinosaur is the Tyrannosaurus Rex, or also known as the T-Rex. Okay, yes, and it's the red dinosaur. What about the green dinosaur? Where is that green dinosaur? That is called the Stegosaurus, that's right. Has these special little points at the top. Okay, this middle dinosaur, where is it? Right there, it has the square. It's the Triceratops. Last but not least, where is this blue dinosaur? It has the semicircle. It's the Ceratosaurus, it's right there. Oh, wonderful friend. Thank you so much for playing with me and we learned about colors and shapes and so much more. Now don't forget to like and subscribe for more adventures. Bye!